um, this is the next cemetery, so I guess it's the Pioneer Cemetery Part 2. And, uh, hope you enjoyed the last one. This one's pretty much the same. And, uh, like I said before, please watch from start to finish because it helps with the watch time hours. And, uh, Please like if you like this video and please subscribe if you like my channel or any of the other videos or if you want to see future videos of Saskatoon or wherever else I end up going because like I said previously I do have family in BC and so forth but right now with COVID pretty much will be mostly Saskatoon or vlog stuff because when it gets to January you don't want to go outside. So, yeah. Well, anyways, I'll uh, see you at the end of this video and uh, enjoy. Now, this one's a massive one. And this gives you an idea of how big it is. See, that there's the river edge. And of course it goes in around there, which I showed you earlier. And then there's the birch trees here. And then that there is the road. And then the exhibition area is right on the other side of the road there. And I think beyond these trees is a park because I think they're playing baseball there. A lovely memory of Eleanor Ruth Clark, James Fraser Robertson, James Fraser Robertson. There are two James Fraser Robertson. I'm guessing offspring, maybe. But look. Someone pulled that out and it's a little tiny grave. And this one's got a whole entire border on. There's another baby gravestone. Interesting. Oh, and there's more on the side. Interesting. This must have been where they took out all the graves. Because it's the edge. Oh. I'll be right back. I'm going to go check out the edge. Well, you can certainly see what they mean by sloping. Sorry, I'm kind of... Isn't the Saskatchewan River beautiful though? And then there's the graveyard. Well, taking a few photos, I've noticed something. There's a gravestone in the middle of those bushes. Let's see if we can't take a peek. Excuse the nauseous movement. That might work a bit better. Yeah. Did you even notice that? Let's see who's hidden in the bush here. Memory of Elrond something or another. Oh, and you're still. Uh, interesting how it grew around that.
My next stop is actually these stones to take a look. Uh, this one's one of the new ones that they've definitely replaced. Brothers Neville, Sifton, and Harold came from Bangor County, Down, Ireland, to Saskatoon in 1885. Their widowed mother Sarah and sister named Muriel followed in 1887. Sadly, just weeks before their arrival, Neville drowned in a ferry accident. In 1892, Sarah Homestead studied the quarter section now defined by Taylor and Ruth and Lauren Avenue and the river. Oh, that's actually a huge amount. She later returned to Ireland and died in 1909. Muriel with husband David Tara Taylor moved to New Zealand and Stephen Stefton to Vancouver. Harold, wife Poppy Clisby, daughters Muriel and Phyllis remained and in 1910 built Pingran House. A 2016 mu. Mu. Uh. Today it's gonna be. Mu. Mu. You can see that word, can't you? Heritage property. At 1919 St. Harry Avenue. Henry Avenue. Pe Pendygrass Road is named after this. In your family. I didn't even know we had a Pindy Grass Road. <laughs> I can see why they updated that one though, if it's such a historical gravestone. Oh, look at the beautiful etching in this one. It's a shame it's kind of falling apart right at there. I wonder if they cracked it when they carved it. Look at this wheat. Oh, pussy willows. Yeah, it looks like they did the whole family. That could be why I'm guessing when they carved the last few names. They accidentally did that. <laughs> and here's a bit of woods. Aren't the birch trees lovely? And you cannot read that whatsoever. Well, wait, age 27 years old, January 14th, 19, 1888. Not Toronto. Uh, I can't even pronounce that word. <laughs> but can't read who it is. <laughs> well, I better stop recording now because this is getting too big. I think it's going to be 18 minutes long, maybe 20. Might cut out some of the walking to shorten it out. But anyways, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed. And I hope you watched from start to finish. And uh, if you like this, please like. And if you check out some of the other videos in, in this channel and you like this, the videos, please subscribe to the channel. And uh... See you next time. Bye. Hey guys, um, this is the end of the cemetery video, so I hope you enjoyed it and uh, see you again next time. Um, thanks for watching from start to finish if you had. It helps with the watch times and it helps. I doubt I'd be able to make an income this year off of YouTube or 
probably in a year. And uh, for those of you who have subscribed, thanks. And uh, if you like my video, if you want to see things on Saskatoon or like my video, like my channel. If you like this video, also hit a like. Um, but like I said, if you like the channel, please subscribe. And uh, talk to you later and uh, see you in November. Bye.